off the turn. Benny Whoa. stays with him. Looking for the dive Whoa. bomb down low. Dobson has it glued. Whoa. Looks nice and racy. Yeah. The Quantum Courts, number 21, they're all upstairs. I fancy the outside position might be the place to run. Put your hands, get it, folks. Sean Dobson gets the first one. Ben Atkinson will start. And Dobson, who is third in the chase and I don't think can be beaten, fourth third place in the chase ultimate sprint car championship point score, will stay out there and run now. Hopefully for a chance to start Whoa. on the third row. Whoa. Position Whoa. six in points, uh. Mitchell Dumsney will now come out to run against him in the 77, Stu. That he was. And a lot of them use these days, of course, the engine heaters that yeah. we never used to have back in the day. No. You used to have to throw the, the horse blanket over the motor, over the bonnet, yeah. but these days those heaters yeah. have been revolutionary. Yeah in the way that I know Adam has developed yeah. his as well. It's just a great product and a lot yeah. of people use it now as well. So it just keeps the temperature up in the motor as best yeah. you can, but the guys all obviously just using yeah. that chance to fire the car anyway. Stu, here we go, yeah. Mitchell against Sean, New South Wales v Tassie. So Mitchell in the Valvoline 77, Dobson in the Essendon Ford 21. Mitchell come out and chose to start on the pole line. We know Dobson's fast no, around the top. Damn. We know Mitchell's been fast around this place over the years. Mitchell gets a cracker and a start on the bottom side. But look at Dobson comes back at him on the outside. Squeeze him going into turn one. Slides up. Mitchell gets an absolute cracker and a run off the bottom down the back straight. Mitchell stays on the bottom. Dobson right through the middle. What a move. That is a Donny Shots move right there. Right through the middle of the racetrack here. Dobson, has he found something in three and four? The way that car stuck yeah. right through the middle part. Went to the bottom a little bit lower. Oh. Give it to Shaw. Dobson, Mitchell will start out of position number seven. So the USC New South Wales Championship next weekend they chase USC Queensland as well. Lights are out. Can Robbie Farr take care of the hot shot? Sean Dobson or will it be the other way around? We're now racing for the third row starting positions. Whoever loses this will start out of position number six. Away we go, Far gets a good launch. Dobson tries to turn it across the middle and gets him. Wow! Robbie went like that. Dobson dives back across the bottom. Sure, Dobson is glued down. That thing is pinning the left rear to the ground and driving away. Come on, Sydney, put your hand together for Sean Dobson. This kid out of Tasmania is hauling it. That is a big scalp right there. Oh, you're not wrong, Dobbo. He's got it worked out. And remember what they did at the start of the night, they did change motors. So I'm not saying this is a smaller motor, so to speak, but it's probably their second motor I would have thought compared to their, their as most guys say, their heavy hitter that they Bentley. Please don't smoke in the grandstands or the grass hill. You need to go out the back, please. You need to get outside the premises. It's not a law that we make. It is a New South Wales law and regulation. Please do not smoke inside the premises. Two laps is the journey. This is to see who's going to start. Position number five. Max goes to the inside as well. Dobson on the outside. If you can make it stick on the bottom side, you can get a run out of turn two. Let's see what Max can do. Dobson, he's confident. He's got his elbows up. But he's up against the uh, man that's done a lot of laps around Australian speedways. And Dobson has just gone whack. Straight up. Through the middle, through three and four. They have got this car worked out. Max. Trying to run him down, but I don't think he's going to be able to do anything about Sean Dobson right now. Dobson keeps moving forward. How about it, Valvoline Raceway? Make some noise for this Essendon Ford, number 21. Max Dumsley will start out of position number five. There, well, he's already moved up a chance of, well, four positions already because whoever wins this one starts out of position four. Sean's dad, Andrew, massive supporter of his. They go everywhere together, those two, based out of Hobart. They do monument work, so they do a lot of granite stuff for 
cemeteries and things like that. They work with quartz and with heavy stone, with monumental works. We wait to go. Jordan Brazier, the Cobra Bins, number 21, the fourth generation racer. Inside, Dobson outside, but a lot of heat in that right rear as we get set to go again. Can Jordan Brazier finish the run of the Tasmanian? Down to one, they run, Dobson takes the spot. Just look at this thing, get down and boogie. This thing is locked down, through the middle, down the bottom, up the top, everywhere he puts it, it is going places. Here's another one, folks. Bang your hands together for Sean Dobson. There's another one. Woohoo! My giddy aunt. This guy is now looking to face Jamie Veal and Sammy Walsh if he can get through this one. Tim, the other thing that I've just noticed, Wade, I just shows how good the racetrack is right now after that scratching of the surface to bring it back. We're out there now doing what we're doing, and Dobson has just done a 12 8 4 8 some three laps ago against Max Dumsney. So, well done to the track curators here at VR for making a track back to where it's going to be racing. Veal now up against Dobson. We know what Jamie Veal's about. He knows how to get his car fast around this place. Dobson, Veal, who's it going to be? Veal gets a real good start. Dobson takes the same line but loses a bit of ground from Veal. Veal gets a good run out of turn two. Dobson, can he start to reel him in down into three and four? Veal went to the top. Dobson went to the bottom. The white lights are a flash and Veal's got him by just 0.015. Veal has got Dobson covered down the back straight. Through turns three and four, Jamie Veal absolutely smashes three and four and he's gone. He will start on the front row tonight, will Jamie Veal. But come on, Valvoline Raceway, how about getting up and making some noise from the bloke out of Hobart in Tasmania. Driving the Essendon Ford number 21, Sean Dobson was due to start out of eight. He will start out of position three. Here is who is about to start on pole tonight in the final grand final of the ultimate sprint car championship between Jamie Veal and the quickest man around Valvoline Raceway, Sammy Walsh in the rocket car. Have we got any Jamie Veal fans in the house? Have we got any Sammy Walsh fans in the house? This is for pole. Sammy goes to the inside line. We get set to go. Oh. Veal goes back to the top. Sammy. Oh, Jamie Veal. It's not over yet. Beautiful pass on the outside. Sammy comes back to the bottom. It's glued down there as well. One down, one to go. Veal is so smooth. Come on, folks. From Waterville, Victoria, on pole will be Jamie Veal. Walsh will start alongside him on the front row. But it's ominous, the SWI number 35. Locked down on pole for tonight's USC chase finale.